So NYU is the world's largest uh, independent research university and was a very early mover in the area of data science and established the first master's program uh, in data science. The PhD program is an interdisciplinary one that um, cuts across the university where people will have the opportunity to take courses from across a number of schools, including the Quran Institute, Computer Science, the Stern School, the Medical School, the Engineering School, Arts and Sciences. So there's a really wide a variety of courses that people will be able to choose from. So since there are established PhD programs in computer science and statistics, for example, uh, it makes sense to consider how the PhD program in data science is different. The emphasis in computer science is on the theory of computation and the design of scalable algorithms and processes. In contrast, data science focuses primarily on the creation of knowledge from data. Statistics focuses on data and inference, but doesn't pay as much attention to the computational aspects and the practical extraction of knowledge from data. In spirit, data science combines both those orientations and others, including optimization, as well as human aspects associated with the extraction of knowledge from data. The emphasis is primarily on inductive methods, where the machine plays an increasing role in the formulation and testing of hypotheses on its own and the creation of knowledge or theory from data. So the PhD program in data science has a number of components. The program consists of five core courses. It includes a research practicum where students rotate among faculty. It provides a teaching component where we train students how to teach, as well as additional electives across the university. There are a number of research projects going on within the university, within and across schools. Some of these involve artificial intelligence and in healthcare. There are other projects involving artificial intelligence in advertising, in finance. There are efforts involved in looking at artificial intelligence for education and the social good more generally. We have projects in physics and astronomy where we're measuring the positions of billions of galaxies in three-dimensional redshift space to build more accurate models of the universe and its origin and using the machine to automatically tell us where there's something interesting happening. In particle physics, evidence for interesting new phenomena sometimes lies in subtle deviations in the expected distributions of data gathered from sensor arrays that measure particle interactions. There's enormous potential for data science techniques to automate, enhance, and reimagine the data analysis strategies for the field. And we have projects directed at making sense of the massive amounts of unstructured, textual, and other types of data being generated by humans and machines every day. So there are a lot of these projects that are already underway, and we expect to see more integration uh, among the schools as we move forward. New York City and Spanish Village downtown is really a hotbed of activity in data science. We have major companies like Google, Facebook, Microsoft, just a stone's throw away from us. Uh, there's a huge amount of activity in startups and fintech that's happening uh, in, in New York City. A number of faculty are on boards of startups uh, and other companies in the space. So it's a, it's a great time to be in this field and it's a great place to be physically in New York City in data science because there's just so much happening. So the Center for Data Science is truly an integrative endeavor that cuts across uh, the various schools and departments within the university. Uh, it's a fertile ground for inquiry um, associated with issues around the technology, uh, human aspects and ethical issues uh, surrounding the use of data. If you find that your interest lies in data science, I would really encourage you to apply. It's a great time to be doing inquiry in this area and it's a great time to be a data scientist.